Hello and welcome back to OAP Gaming and The Last Remnant Remastered. In today's episode, we are going to be doing Roberto's third quest. What I've done is I've topped up my potions and that, and I've also decided that it's too risky just having one union which can res. So I've got rid of Pegasus, my invocations, and brought in another combat unit which can also res. So we've got two unions now which can res. I've still kept my hexes, and of course I've got my dedicated heal units. Once they go up a little bit more, they will also be able to res, so then we may switch these out again. So, that's what we've done when I wasn't recording. So, let's get on and do Roberto's third quest. What does he want us to do this time? Just a heads up, I know what he wants us to do. But, uh... So once again, we have to talk to the Knight of Melfina. So, back to the castle. And this is the third quest. It is also the final quest for Roberto. Of course, we will help. We are ready. Let us go. So here we are back in Crookfen. The seal we repaired has been broken and we now have to defeat these. Now these evil eyes can be a problem. So I'm going to close in there. Can't target, okay. Okay, you can close in there.
Coming at you! Time for a clobbering! Slime like you are creeping around. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. Come on, let's kick some A. That's what the evil eyes will do. They'll keep attacking Don't from worry. the sidelines Thanks. until you take them out. That's why this can be a, a little bit tricky if you don't be careful what you're doing. Watch yourself this time, okay? 
from our flank! Prepare yourself! Excellent. We learn rejuvenating water. For those of you who don't know, rejuvenating, rejuvenating water is an area of effect healing, so it heals all your units who are engaged in combat, which is brilliant. So let's have a look. Yes, you can do that. Bring them back. And as you are probably seeing, oh, another rejuvenating water, that's brilliant. As you're seeing, rule of the Mr. Cats, etc., who we 
fought in the first of Roberto's quest. They're all here, but this time they're together so to take on all three of them at once, as well as taking care of these annoying evil eyes. There we go. So let's have a look. No, we don't want you there. We want you to come and take these on first. Or shall we be our shield? Yes, let's go that way first, be our shield. Can you come to them? Yes, you can. So turn it around. There we go. That looks all right to me. Too many misses, people. Oh, we've been raided. Oh, they're gonna go up against my healer unit. No. Leave these beans to me. That's okay. Um, let's have a look. Uh, I'm going to bring them back. You are going to turn it around. You're going to do that. Oh, I wasn't expecting that, to be honest. I was not expecting that. again stop attacking my healing unit ruler of the shields okay okay that's fine that's fine okay let's have a look here that's an evil eye there, that's an evil eye there. Uh, you... Bring them back. Oh my god, we've got to bring them back and all. Yes. Oh, we can't do that. Oh. We're stuck with this then. Well, this is not looking good.
Underestimate them! Comes in handy that rejuvenating water. This is why I have a dedicated healing unit for that specific reason. So yes, I think we're up in there. Okay, you can take them on. Uh, ooh, shields. Let's have a look. Put them. That looks good to me. You can take them on. And Matea. You can do that as well. No, come this way, come this way. Stay on your toes for now. Two down, one to go.
too easy. Sweet. I won't I say that, Emmy. Stronger than before. See that? I'm constantly growing stronger. I feel stronger than I did before. It's tricky up until you get rid of the evil eyes because they keep attacking from the sideline doing some serious damage. Grab Carapace. Yes, you want that. Dark Fiend talent. Oh, yes, we wanted four of those and we got three in the last time and yeah so that's good Let's see what else we've got last one who you text on let me just have a look at you irregular torpedo i think voice and steel yeah okay i'm happy with that yes And once again, we have to make a choice, just like we did in the other two times. And again, on this occasion, we are going to side with Roberto.
and we get 20,000 gold, not to be sniffed at. And we get a Melfina certificate of gratitude. It does nothing. You don't get anything for it. It doesn't improve anything. We just get a certificate of gratitude. So we can now hire Roberto if we wish. I'm just checking something. Okay, that's okay. So what I will do, I will just... You are combat art, obviously, Bolson. Yes, we do know it. I'll just show you Roberto in the guild before we move on. You'll find uh, a few more of the knights are available as well. Yes, we have been there. There's Roberto, <laughs> just over 25 and a half thousand. He is a good person to have. He comes pretty well developed. And he does, and you've got Neo, of course. Nicely developed herbs, vinery. These are the knights we were saving on that. So they all come pretty well developed. If you wish to do this, Lucara, very good can do the spark, the invocation should I say, or can do the hexes, if you wish, to hire them. And we've got Munia, and we've got Bugsy. So there you go. Any of, all of these are very good additions to your party, should you wish to use them. But as you can see, Roberto is the most expensive. On this occasion, I, I might hide him later on, but I don't think I'm going to use him. I don't think so. I might do, but I don't think I will. So, let me get out of here. Back to the world map. And I think that is a good place to stop. What I normally do is, before I actually do the, the third quest, I normally uh, take on the Crimson Ape and things like that. So we'll do that in the next one, I think. And let's see what else. I'm just looking at my notes. Ah, yes, we've got a lot of rare hunting. So let's have a look. Yes. I'll do all that off camera. It's only opening up a treasure chest and getting a bit of silver ore. Yes, so in the next episode, what we'll do is we'll take on the Crimson Ape. And we'll be doing more rare hunting. We've got quite a few because they are guild tasks and we want to 100% the game, so we have to do them. Whether you like it or not, if you want to 100% the game, you're going to have to do it. So, yes, we will do that in the next episode. So, I'll end it here. If you've enjoyed this video, please consider hitting that like button. Please leave a comment. Good, bad, or indifferent. I appreciate them all. And maybe even consider subscribing to the channel. It really helps me out. And I hope I will see you in the next episode. Like I say, we will be doing a lot of rare hunting. So if you wonder where you get these particular rares from, the next episode is the perfect one to watch. So until then, thank you very much indeed for watching. It really is appreciated.